Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Uh, in today's video, we will see how we going to add points to our map. Uh, it could be a steady map or whatever map it is. So first of all, we have to clear uh, our environment and follow it by setting working directory. After doing this, we need to uh, load required uh, package for these particular activities like SF package, ggplot package for visualization and gg is special package to add nodes arrow and, and scale nicely to our map. Then uh, after doing all this, uh, we need to read our shape file. Uh, our shape file is located in the particular uh, directory that we set up and then after we read using st underscore read uh, function, which is found in SF uh, package, and we give any name for our shape file to memorize for further further root further use. This is name of our shape file here. Then we uh, plot and see what our shape file is looks like, whether it is uh, rightly read into the environment or it has some sort of maybe artifacts or any uh, other problems to check out. Uh, after doing this, we move further, uh, subsetting the shape that we are interested. For example, if we are interested for particular region or if we are interested in particular word, we need to subset that particular shape file. Here you can see how nicely the Ethiopia with uh, Woreda administration is, is appear here, but it is not nice to see like it is very congested and it's not very attractive. Then we have to subset uh, uh, our interest region. In this case, our interest region is Sidama region, which is newly established and we select the uh, Sedama region by using subset function and giving the name of our existing shape file. Then after doing that also, we plot and see whether the Sedama region is uh, correctly subsetted out. And yeah, here you go. You can see it is uh, correctly subset uh, from, from the Ethiopia, uh, uh, I mean shape file. So only thing we miss is here Lake Awasa, but we can add lakes also in maybe another week video, we will come back how we can add that one. Uh, if our uh, points data is not, not located in the same directory, uh, we need to again say the, I mean the directory where our points data is, is located. So our points data is not located in the same directory, then we set back to the other directory here. And then we read uh, our uh, points data using, because it is CSV file, CSV file is like extension of the Excel file. And we read using read CSV function into the R environment. So it is appearing here. Uh, we can see how many uh, points are there also using this uh, view function and we can see name is there, latitude is there, longitude is there and name of the weather stations uh, are there in this case. So then finally, uh, now we are on the stage to create map and points together. Then to create map, we use ggplot. Then we are creating Sidama region. We already subsetted and we have Sidama. Then we put Sidama. And then after we only use like this g geom sf uh, function to add only like the shape without any putting any color like black and white, only making lines of the borders of Waredas as, as lines. Then after we put a plus sign, actually we keep adding in 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 
to be put, the good thing is we can keep adding anything necessary for our plot uh, or for our map. Then we add geom points. A uh, geom points is located in in data set as a data set. We named as log. Then log, we bring log, and then aesthetic. We're going to give lat and and long, and we would like to our. Uh, I mean, point scalar uh, would be weight and the size would be a two. Normally, two is like nicely uh, visible for, for presentation and for other things in this case. Then this thing in between is to add grids, uh, grid lines on, on the top of our map. Then otherwise, we're going to add uh, annotation scale I mean, the scale of the map and then uh, nose arrow of the map. After adding all this, we only make uh, run this uh, code. Then after we will have a nice map uh, with point and, and shape here. Uh, so uh, normally for a special uh, analysis or for a special application, our text uh, a little bit time. So here is the map uh, having points all over the uh, the region. Uh, of course, uh, the location precision of the location for some points is not that good. It's failing uh, outside of like the the region. Uh, anyhow, this is how we can add points to our map. Uh, thank you very much for your attendance and see you with another video.